And that's the thing about it is that we we live in a day and age now where nobody has individuality. Everybody has this hive mindset. So if my fellow brother and sister, I see them doing it, I'm going to do it. If I see their opinion about this, even if I have an opposite opinion, I'm going to side with them. I'm going to side with the masses. And we just see it. We see it a lot nowadays. You know, take, for example, take, for example, Drake's new album, right? Whether you like it or not, I've personally seen, which I do like it. I've seen a, a bunch of people kind of say things and then the crowd kind of follows them like, oh, yeah, it's trash. You know, I see it a lot on YouTube where somebody make a video about their opinion and then somebody will, it's been on my video, somebody will comment something and then all of a sudden you have everybody else saying the same thing. Not that they don't necessarily agree, but it seems like it's such a hive mindset. Like, where is the individuality? If you like the album, right, just say you like the album. Doesn't mean that your opinion is trash. Doesn't mean that, you know, like, why, why are we afraid nowadays to have our own opinions? Like, why? And it seems like if you if you have your own opinion and it doesn't side with the masses, then all of a sudden, you know, you're lame or that's a uh, that's a trash take. I see it a lot. That's a trash take. Right. But for me, I stand on I stand on what I believe in. Right. Because it's my opinion. You know, I'm not saying it's fact. It's just my opinion. You know, I, I'm not trying to bring it up, but even what happened with you know, the pandemic, you know, a couple of years ago, whatever. There were a lot of different opinions on that. And a lot of people kind of just went along with whatever the media told them or friends or whatever. Like they went along, even if you had your own opinion on it, like if everybody's saying like, oh, this is bad or this is good, you're going to side with that. Even if you, you know what I mean? I don't know. I just, I just wish we we're able to be ourselves, our authentic selves, whatever that means to us. And like for us to, be bold on our opinion and stand by it regardless of everybody over here agrees everybody over here disagrees does anybody really care does anybody really care like i think i think as an artist sometimes i'm personally i can always speak for myself i'm personally nervous to put out even sometimes videos but my photography or different things i'm creating because i know that there's going to be you know, someone that doesn't like it, and that's fine. It's just the whole, you know, herd mentality really just puts a sour taste in my mouth, you know, in terms of doing things. And I'm not, of course, I just put it out there. I'm not really concerned about the the good praise or the bad praise because it's it's it's, it's good to like see right for constructive criticism uh, purposes. But at the end of the day, like. It doesn't matter you know what i mean because people are going to have an opinion based on it regardless you know that and so i know that and so for me it's about just being authentic to myself and and understanding that regardless of that opinion just put it out there because there 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 are people who you know like you never know who who needs your work you know i've realized that like you never know especially when, you know me making videos or whatever I, as multiple times people inbox me inbox me or email me telling me how you know they needed this message or they really understand what I'm going through or they ask me questions and stuff and it's 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 warming to me because I'm like man if I can inspire or influence people then you know that's great I have I went back home you guys know uh this past weekend and I met a family friend not when I met her but I it's been a while since I talked with him probably like year and a half two years and he told me he was plant-based and now mind you this guy's in his 50s married with kids very like you know uh he's retired he used to be like a a rig worker he's like a very masculine guy like from louisiana eat meat like you, you know you wouldn't expect him but he told me that he he told me that looking at my pictures and looking where I came from, like it really inspired him to start his journey and to really like, you know, stop eating meat, 
he eats eggs and, and cheese sometimes, but he stopped eating meat and I mean, he's lost so much weight, but it's just cool that I can inspire people like that. You know, like I, I live for those moments, you know, no matter what it is, that's the thing. If I get one like, if I get 50 likes, you know, I know that I'm inspiring people, you know what I mean? And so that, that keeps me going. That keeps me going because I know I'm inspired. All I really wanted to say, stop, stop swaying, stop going over here, going over here. Whatever you like, that's that's what makes you you. Like that's what makes you like. Even if you weird, but like that's what makes you you is you liking whatever you like. So don't don't go with the herd just to, you know what I mean? Like just to have that take. Like no, if you don't like onions, you don't like onions. If everybody here eat onions, what whatever, you know? Like, just be you, man, and stop trying to stop trying to fit in by trying to change what you like. It's it's just very annoying. It's very annoying. And this generation seems to really sometimes they just I don't know. It feels like they hate stuff just to hate it. Like this Like if you see if you see somebody put out something and there's 15 people like really genuinely like it there's going to be one person that's just going to say oh this is trash just just to disrupt the flow of stuff you know it's always a, i'm not saying they're a troll but it's always somebody's going to go against you know somebody put up a dope ass like music video and it's 15 people to 30 people like man this is cold this is a great this is, this is awesome right it's going to be that one person that's like mm, i really didn't like it this is this is not it for me you know you always see this is not it for me or this is trash or you could have kept this like and then you see then after that then you see all the comments of you know people saying the same thing so it's just that's why you can't worry about it you just got to keep doing you so just keep putting your art out i encourage you to just you know if you're an artist or not just keep doing what you're doing and don't be affected by the negative positive effects um the positive or negative comments because it's gonna happen anyway okay so just keep putting your shit out there and don't worry about you know don't worry about um don't worry about the comments okay i look like i'm hot but I'm, I'm i'm really not i'm just i'm relaxed it's been a chill day it's very hot here it's like it's like 104 degrees yeah it's like 104 degrees and i'm sitting here with a beanie on with the windows up with no air I'm crazy, ain't it? I know.